Well, the Postal Service sure has been having issues with packages recently. My order, the second wave of Paldane Fates products shipped just before release day and were seemingly on their way. But I found out after several days they just moved kind of across town. It was back and forth with the store, USPS, and no one seemed to know where the package was. And then the last time I talked to USPS, they said, hey, they could probably be lost. But luckily, literally five minutes after that call, the package was in my area and will be out for delivery the very next day. Now, I was going to split this into two videos, but in celebration of finally getting this package, let's go for that shiny, special illustration rare Charizard and rip some Paldean Fates. Hello everyone, welcome back to Chasing the Zard. Hope you're having a great day. Finally, I get to do my second opening of Paldean Fates. Now this package was lost in the mail for a good while, but it's finally here. And we have the set of three tins, we have a set of three premium collection boxes. And also I do have the booster bundle, which technically released two weeks after all these, but uh, actually got here first. All right, since I'd like to work from smallest to biggest product, we're gonna start with the tins, have five packs, then go to the booster bundle, and then finally the collection boxes. All right, here's our first tin. It is the Iron Treads EX tin. And this comes with the Black Star promo and five packs. All right, here is the Black Star promo. Uh, actually, this one has actually really good centering. A little bit bowed, but I mean, that happens in these tins. Good texture on it, though. And then we have our first set of five packs. And Oma used the products as a backdrop, but we have three tins and three of the big boxes. It's just not going to fit. So we're just going to use the back and probably really fill it up. All right, so obviously the things to pull here, we have the regular Charizard EX, and we also have the Charizard EX SIR, uh, which is, SIR is apparently really hard to pull in the set. Um, uh, shiny is pretty common though, so, so we get a baby shiny. Oh, we have, oh, no, we got a big shiny. Pidgeot EX full art, hell yeah. Charmander Reverse and Magmortar regular hollow. That is a great hit to start. On to pack number two. Of course, the other SRs, you have the Gardevoir EX SIR. There's the Mew EX. I mean, I want to pull both. They both look fantastic. Dr drastically different art styles, but they look great. Uh, there's a bunch of SIR trainers, too. I think there's at least Eono, uh, Nimona, Arvin, Clive. I want to say Penny as well. We have Barbo Traverse, Armor Rouge Reverse, and Spathra EX. All right, hit number two. On to pack number three. Now coming into this, I think I have six uh, six of the baby shinies. There's about 120, uh, so there's a lot to pull. Uh, or is there 90? No, I can't remember. I'll have to look it up. I'll put up here whether I'm right or wrong. Uh, but yeah, uh, it's a good way to go with the regular baby shinies. I think I have two of the full arts, not including this one. Uh, but we have Rolls Reverse, Fridgebacks Reverse, and Cyclozar Regular Hollow. On to pack number four. Now, there's also three regular IRs. There's the Palafin, there's the Wug Trio, and the, was it Palmy or Palmo or Palmot? I don't know which evolution it is. It's one of those three. Uh, I've pulled the Palafin twice, so hopefully we pull the other two in this opening. I mean, I, watching openings, people get them pretty commonly. We have Grap Locked, Mankey. All right, there's a good baby shiny. Mankey Reverse and Armor Rouge Regular Hollow. All right, our last pack before we go to the next 10. I will say, uh, it seems like these products are becoming like a little more readily available. Uh, so hopefully, hopefully these packs get cheaper. Cause it, w it would be fun to try to get all the baby, all, all the shiny vault. I guess is not what it's called in this, but it's part of the set. Um, the previous ones, it was a shiny vault. Uh, it would be a lot of fun to do. But I, unless the packs get pretty cheap, I don't think I can afford that. We have Grievar Reverse, Charcadet Reverse, and another, this is my third Clive. I've done two openings and I have three of these, which seems to be a common trend hey but that's five packs and four hits that that's pretty good now it's time for the great tusk ex10 all right here is that black star promo and then our next five packs all right let's crack into this so i mean the first five packs we had we had four hits that's a better than unusual uh hit rate uh, so hopefully, hopefully that continues. It won't, it won't, but we'd like it to. Charmeleon, uh, we have camera up Fortress EX, full art. Okay, I think I might have this one. Technical Machine Crisis Punch and Sir Ledge, regular hollow. 
Yeah, so the shiny full art's also called shiny, I think, ultra rares. Um, are not that hard to pull. Uh, I see everyone pulling them all the time, so hopefully we can get some different ones, though, besides that. You know, I'm sure I'm going to get another Paldean Claude Sire at some point, because that always happens. Uh, in terms of the baby shines, I do want to pull the set. I mean, I definitely want to pull the Charmander, Charmeleon, um, any, really any of the 151 shinies, because I'm, I'm a Kanto kid. You know, I grew up playing Pokemon Red. Uh, we have Camera Reverse, Golden Egg, uh, Goldengo Reverse, and Annihilate Brigham Hollow. Back number three. I must say, I'm, I'm a little surprised there's no shiny EVs or evolutions uh, in this set. I mean, there's a shiny EV and shiny face from the ETB. Uh, I don't know how, what else was in there, I can't remember. Um, but I don't remember seeing a lot of shiny evolution cards. Oh, we have Toll School, uh, shiny, baby shiny, and Wug Trio illustration rare. There's, there's the only kind of double hit you can get. I mean, this can also be a special illustration rare um but you can only get a double hits in the first two slots or the final rare slot <laughs> i'm gonna run out of space here really fast on the bright side i know i'm gonna pull another clive so that one can just go right there we have magmar nimona charmander gengar oinkalone artisan moss old reverse professor research reverse and magmortar regular hollow also, we already have three hits, so if there's a hit in here, these tens are strangely consistent. All right, we have Grievot. Oh, speaking of Pikachu, that Pikachu baby shiny would be one to pull, too. Uh, we have Mosshold, Iono, Kilowattril, Dedenne Reverse, Mashif Reverse, and Executor Regular Hollow. Actually, I kind of like that, that Executor art. All right, now we're on to the Charizard EX-10. All right, here is the one of the newest Charizards. There are three new Charizards in total because this is a Black Star promo. There's two more in the set. We can update that counter up there because we have another Charizard. I do wish they went with the Charizard EX full art from uh, the Charizard EX premium collection that came out. It, it just looks better. This is the one from Obsidian Flames. It's not terrible, but it's not my favorite either. All right, and the last five packs from the tens. All right, so this is pack number 11 overall. Would it be crazy if there's a Charizard in the Charizard 10? Yes, it would. Scraggy, Mime Jr., Mashif, Kirlia, Graplocked, Crisis Punch, Chimeko, Mashif Reverse and uh, another Paldean student. I don't know if this is the one I already have. I think I think I have the other version, so I have both versions of this card now. All right, now to pack number two. All right, let's see. We have Wubat, Fanpy, Dedene, Noibat, Moonlit Hill, Camerupt, Atticus, Noiverny X, Full Art. All right. Dosh Bun and Surledge Regular Hollow. So actually, you get these in the first reverse slot, so I guess the best you could do is a full art shiny, or shiny ultra rare, and then a shiny special illustration rare. That would be the best possible double hit. All right, two packs, two hits. Let's see if we can keep it going. Pack number three. All right, we have Paldean Student, Fido, Haunter, Cottony, Lantern, Oinkalone, Clive, Wiggly, Tough, sh Baby, Shiny, all right. River Room, Reverse Hollow, and Mac Mortar, Regular Hollow. That's three hits. All right, see, there's still more magic in pack number four. All right, we have Execute, Ghastly, Ralts, Ultra Ball, Moz Hold, Moonlit Hill, Heat Road in Reverse, Palafin, all right, illustration rare one I have, but a hit. And Executor, regular hollow. I knew there was no way I wasn't going to pull this again. Uh, I, at this point, I'm most expecting uh, what, Shiny Halucha. It's the one I kept pulling last time. All right, the first 10 had four hits. The second one had, what was that, three hits. Uh, so this one is already at four. Again, the hit rates for Paladin Fates can be absolutely crazy.
left that one open kind of weird. We have Maractus, Gimmigool, Scraggy, Flittle, Primate, Ultra Ball, Mozhold, Crisis Punch Reverse, Camera Up Reverse, and Annihilate Regular Hollow. All right, that's it for the tins, but now we're on to the booster bundle. All right, these in the building battle boxes are like the hardest thing to open. All right, and this will have six packs, so, you know, one more than the tins. Now under our first pack. All right, now these release, I think, on the 23rd, which is at this point, I think, what, last Friday uh, when this comes out, probably. Yeah, thereabouts. Um, I w I'm curious to see if it's going to do the same thing as the 151 uh, booster bundle. It just goes crazy and impossible to find half the time. Hopefully not. Hopefully these are readily available uh, and it doesn't go crazy prices. We have not to reverse. Nimona's backpack reverse and Houndstone regular hollow. Pack number two. Well, here's hoping the tins didn't use up all our luck. We have Jinjao, Wubat, Camerupt, Atticus, Donphan, Charmander, baby shiny, there we go. Toast Cruel Reverse and Bostiff Regular Hollow. That's a shiny we want to pull. One of the best ones, has to be. All right, just need that Charmeleon and that uh, Charizard EXSIR now. Pack number three. We have Nimona, Charmander, Rare Candy, Kilowattril, Clive, Charmeleon, Electric Generator Reverse, Kilowattril Reverse, and Zatu Regular Hollow. All right, pack number four. We have Scraggy, Gimmigool, Magmar, Nimona, Nest Ball, Graplocked, Iono, Magmar, Reverse, Raichu Reverse, and River Room Regular Hollow. Oh yeah, this Booster Bundle is doing nowhere as good as those tins. Alright, we have Frigibax, Binko, Numel, Natu, Crisis Punch, Dosh Bun, Moss Hold, Natu, Baby Shiny, there we go, Lapras Reverse, and Raichu Regular Hollow. Yeah, I don't mind covering up Clive there. All right, our last pack for this booster bundle. I mean, two hits, six packs, that's totally fine. Uh, the tins overperformed. Yeah, I've not pulled a lot of the regular EXs, which is, I feel like that always happens to me. The regular EXs are like the hardest thing for me to pull in like all these Scarlet Violet sets. We have Gengar Reverse, Gardevoir EX. All right, there's a good full art. Pineco Reverse and Annihilate Regular Hollow, another full art shiny. Now that we've finished the booster bundle, let's move on to the premium collections, starting with Meowskarata. Alright, there's stuff falling off the back of this plastic. It's kind of weird. Alright, so this premium collections come with a whole bunch of stuff. We're going to start off with the first Black Star promo, the Baby Shiny Sprigatito. Then we have the Baby Shiny Florigato. And finally, the Meowskurata EX Full Art Shiny. And of course, there's a Jumbo in here. Now, each of these boxes does come with eight packs, so it's you know it's a pretty good chunk of packs in here. Uh, but finally, the last thing is this three card display stand. Now, this is much like the ones in the premium collections, the Gyarados CX and Charizard DX. Uh, it works on magnets. I think it's probably Ultra Pro brand. Not 100 percent sure, uh, but I'm not going to put the cards in. We'll do that for uh, let's say we do it for the Fuecoco Skeleturge one. All right, but here's the eight packs. So let's get started. All right, we have Mime Jr., Noibat, Jimeko, Ghastly, Nimona's Backpack, Dosh Bun, Nest Ball, Oink Alone, Baby Shiny, Toast School, and Zatu, Regular Hollow. I must say that is the most pig-like looking pig Pokemon that I've seen them do. Like that just, that is just a pig. Pack number two. 
Right. Let's see what we can get out of this pack. Uh, now, can these have eight packs? I mean, I think the hit rates seem to be like one every hit every one and a half packs. So you'd expect maybe like two to three hits. We have Killer Reverse, Chinchar Reverse, and Sarah Luch Regular Hollow. Pack number three. I do think so far I've had probably slightly better than the regular hit rate uh, in all the stuff I've opened. Um, and I'm sure it'll come back down at some point. <laughs> the boost bundle I opened uh, had a pretty regular hit rate, I think. Mono's Backpack, Haunter Reverse, Primate Reverse, and Iron Trezzy Z. Uh, uh, Iron Tread ZX. So there's one of the regular EXs. But pack number four. Hopefully, hopefully one of these boxes has one special illustration rare. Even, even if it's a trainer, I'll take a trainer. I just, I want to pull one of them. We have Whimsicott, Scrafty, Noibat Reverse, Dedenne Reverse, and Goldengo Regular Hollow. Pack number five. Ah, man, it is really hard for me actually to remember what's in this set because half these arts are like reprints. Like this is the Charmander in, I think, Obsidian Flames. Uh, so I look at it and I'm like, I remember that I'm sitting in flames. I don't remember what, if it's in uh, Paladin Fates or not. So it's just starting to confuse me a little bit. Uh, we have Charcadet Reverse, Haunter Reverse, and a Bostiff Regular Hollow. All right, we have pack number six here. All right, I think that's what, two hits so far in five packs. So we'll see if this can up at any. Uh, I mean, I'm assuming we have three packs left, including this one. We'll probably get one more hit. That's the Ono. Garganockle. All right. Baby Shiny. Chinchow Reverse and Bostiff Regular Hollow. So there's another hit. All right. So that's three hits, six packs. That's a pack, you know, hit every other pack. That's pretty good. All right. Uh, maybe, maybe one more hit in these last two packs. So that would put us up to four in total. We have Technical Machine Crisis Bunch, Dosh Bun, Cyclozar Reverse, Paldean Looper Reverse, and Rubber Room Regular Hollow. All right, last pack for the Miascarada box. All right, uh, we have Paldean Student, Fido, Haunter, Cottony, Ultra Ball, Moss Hold, Moonlit Hill, Yono Reverse, Haunter Reverse and Amarush Regular Hollow. So only three hits in that box. All right, now for the Quaqua Ball box. So this piece keeps falling out of the boxes. I realize what it is now. This is this is part of the stand uh, that comes with it. It has that slot right here. This should be perfect for it. But uh, yeah, they, they cheaped out on these, really. They couldn't give us just the regular ones, plastic ones like they had in the Charizard and Gyarados X boxes. All right, this one has the Quaxly Shiny Black Star promo. Then we have Quaxwell. And finally, the Quaquaval EX Full Art Shiny. And here's the Jumbo. Another eight packs. And another display case. All right, pack number one. I'm, I'm a little surprised that they took the starters out of the set. I feel like people would want to They'd want to pull those. I'm also surprised there's no illustration rares or special illustration rares for those uh, in the set. Because, I mean, you're not going to see them shiny too often, so this would be the place to put them. We have Iona Reverse. Palm Me Illustration Rare. There's the other one. All right. And Zatu Regular Hollow. So now we have all the illustration rares that are in this set. All right, pack number two. I'm actually pleasantly surprised that I've not doubled up as much as I thought I would. Uh, so far in this set, I mean, the first opening, yeah, it was a little bit too much doubling up for that small amount that I opened. Uh, but so far in this opening, I think I pulled like maybe four things already have. Oh, we have a uh, baby shiny here. We have at <laughs> the moment I talk about doubling up. Let me guess there'll be a palafin behind it. Nope, just a regular toad school. Uh, yeah, OK, well, that teaches me to talk about doubling up. I'll just shut up now. All right, on to pack number three. You know, when I was opening that pack and I decided to talk about doubling up, I, I had that thought of, huh, don't say that. That's a terrible idea to say that. That's going to jinx it. And then, of course, it uh, it jinxed it. So uh, obviously this pack's going to have the Charizard SIR. Why not? Let's uh, let's do that jinx. Never works that way, does it? 
uh, we have Electric Generator Reverse, Kilowatt Roll Reverse, and Houndstone Regular Hollow. All right, let's go on to pack number four. Let's see if we can get to three hits a little earlier than the last box, since that box I think ended with three hits, 40 at two. So I think I would hope in these last five packs that there is one more, if not two more hits. Pleasure Generator, Moss Hold, Alakazam EX, Full Art Shiny, there we go. Pikachu Reverse and Heat Rotom Regular Hollow, that's a good hit. Although interesting, I don't think there's not a Shiny Abra or Kadabra in this set, is there? It's just Alakazam? Am I imagining that? I might be. All right, I had to look at the player's guide. There is a shiny Abra and a shiny Kadabra. Uh, so those are, the shiny Abra definitely is on my I want to pull list right now. Uh, that along, and I guess I got the Charmander. I want the Charmeleon and the Pikachu. Those are definite wants. But on to the second half of these packs. That also does have us already at three hits. So we'll uh, see if, okay, as long as there's something in these, uh, other ones, I think actually I do see one in there. Um, that just means the first box, you know, underperformed a little bit. It's gonna happen. There's not a guaranteed hit rate in these. We have Gengar, Lechonk, all right, Baby Shiny, Oink Lone Reverse, and Nihilate Burglar Hollow. So we do have the full Lechonk line now. All right, doing big openings like this, I'm uh, sorely out of space. So if you have any good options or ideas like how to display cards during these openings, hit me up in the comments, let me know. Pack number six. All right, let's see what we can pull from here. We have the Junk, Execute, Ghastly, Dosh Bun, Numotus Backpack, Primate, Ghastly Reverse, Miraculous Reverse, and Arm Rouge Regular Hollow. Pack number seven. Uh, so if you're at all wondering where I got that kind of the odds where it's like a hit in every one and a half pack, uh, that was actually from Danny Phantom. He did a video going over like all the packs he opened and what he pulled and the numbers. And I think it came out to like a hit every one and a half packs, which was, I think, slightly better than Crown Zenith, according to him. But I'll link to that video up here so you can check it out. It's actually pretty interesting to see him go over all the numbers. Uh, and just because he opens up so many packs. We have Ralts Reverse. Charmander Reverse and Goldango Regular Hollow. Oh, that dropped. All right, the last pack. This is our only chance to get to five hits here. All right, let's see what we can pull. We have Maractus, Paladin Student, Lapras, Scrafty, Swoobat, Artisan, Relor Baby Shiny. All right, there's hit number five. Paladin Student and Professor's Research Regular Hollow. So I, I need someone who knows to comment. Is is this basically a dung beetle, right? That's the pile of dung, and that's the beetle pushing it. That's it's a dung beetle. All right, but now we're on to our final box, the Skeleturge EX Premium Collection. All right, first up we have the Fue Coco Shiny. Then we have Crocolor. And finally, Skeleturge EX Full Art Shiny. Of course, a jumbo our last eight packs and not forget the final display protector, which I'm going to put the cards in and get. Let's see how it looks. And again, yeah, this this is the stand. I guess I have to keep all these plastic parts around if I ever want to display the other two. Uh, it's kind of weird. It should just been a better, like more durable, permanent plastic base. All right, let's knock out these last eight packs. All right, so out of the two boxes in total, we got, what was that, eight hits, uh, three and five. So, you know, you're expecting, I guess, a four hits box, uh, which is like two, uh, pa a hit every two packs. So there we go. Uh, so we'll see if this one uh, maintains that or is a little better. Artisan Reverse, Palafin Illustration Rare, all right. And Sir Ledge Regular Hollow. Uh, yeah, I, again, I knew I was going to pull another one of these. All right, pack number two. It, it feels like it's time for a special illustration rare. Come on, you gotta, gotta get one, just one, even a trainer. I'll take a trainer. But something, you know, that Clive art's really funny. I like it. I love to pull it. New more reverse. 
Tandem Mouse Reverse, and Paladin Gladsire EX. I think this is one I do have, sadly. All right, pack number three. All right, Lapras, Scraggy, Mime Jr., Mashif, Artisan, Curlia, Nimona's Backpack, Luxio. All right, there's a good baby shiny. Camera Traverse and Bostiff Regular Hollow. My daughter does like Shinx, but she's never seen a shiny Shinx, so uh, I probably should pull some duplicates of that one if I can. Pack number four. I think at this point, besides the Oink Loan, the Charmander, and the Wiggly Tough, <laughs> you can't tell what any of that stuff is. Uh, yeah, I need, I need a better solution for that. We have Gengar. Charmeleon, I think we got we got a fire shiny. Wink clone. Paldean Taurus, fire type, rever uh, shiny, all right. Chonk reverse and Mickey regular hollow. All right, that's four packs, four hits. Uh, so assuming we don't strike out completely in these remaining packs, this is probably gonna be the best of the three boxes. All right, pack number five. All right, we have Clubopus. Room, Banky, Magmar, Kilowattril, Nest Ball, Lantern, Charmander Reverse, Ghastly Reverse, and Toastcrew EX. All right, that's hit number five. Jeez. And suddenly I can pull the regular EXs. Pack number six. All right, uh, I don't, there's no way we get a hit in every pack in this box, so let's just temper our expectations there. I think that was what, hit number five? As is 13 hits out of three boxes, so that's pretty good. We have Subat, Gengar, Atticus Reverse, Palmy Illustration Rare. Never mind, we can't get six in a row, and he wrote him regular hollow. Alright, there's that uh that Palmy again. Yeah, this this these two packs are gonna be empty. That's just the odds. It's not gonna be seven hits out of eight packs, it's not gonna happen. Do I want that to happen? Hell yes, but uh, I'm realistic. I know it's not. All right, we have Whimsicott, Scrafty, Swoobat, Pineco Reverse, Clubopus Reverse, and Judge Full Art. Okay, what the hell? All right, this is this is the last pack. The question is, does it have a hit? Will this be? Oh, it is technically a perfect box. No, it, it the odds are so strongly against this having a hit. Um, but let's, you know, I'll do my uh, what was I going to do my uh, little pack flip for the last pack, last pack magic. Uh, yeah, that, that didn't work last time. But it's probably not going to work this time. All right, but if you're still watching, I definitely hope you subscribe. Um, I will be doing more Paldean Fates in the future. Going to do a little Pal Pal uh, Paldean Fates versus Shiny Fates. Person hidden fates uh, should be fun. It's gonna rank all the uh, all the 2023 sets. Open like a booster bundle for each should be should be pretty fun. We have uh, Clive, Charmeleon, Artisan Reverse, New Mole Reverse. Okay, this is gonna be a perfect box. Dose Cruel X actually. Oh wow, eight for eight. Uh, unexpected. We did pull this one twice, but. Uh, yeah, that was a hit in every single pack in that box. That's crazy. All right, so we have a huge block of hits here. Actually, not that many duplicates I thought there would be. Uh, but let's you know, look through them. Of course, start off with two duplicates. Uh, but yeah, Palais and Fates, a very, very generous set because there's a lot of stuff to pull. There's a lot of shinies. Uh, love that Charmander. But yeah, great set. I think this was a really fun opening. I had a lot of fun. Opened a lot of products, so that's going to you know increase your number of hits, typically. Still no special illustration rares, but a ton of full eyes I didn't have. A ton of shinies I didn't have. I think I got, I don't think I doubled up on a single baby shiny I already had. Uh, hopefully, I'll know after I film this. Uh, but thanks for watching. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe. Let me know if you open any of these products. Let me know what you got out of them. Uh, let me know what else you'd like to see me open. And I'll see you on the next video.